Okay, so here we are uh, on the homepage of the website. Now, first thing is avoid the login at the top. All right, this here. Uh, this is more. This is the bride login. We're going to have this be clarified a little bit better as we move forward. Keep in mind, in general, that this is uh, a our brand new relaunch, and already we have a lot of tweaks that we want to make to it. So what you're going to do is scroll down, like I'm doing here, to the bottom, and you want to click on vendor login. Okay, so click there. You want to click register first because you don't have a login yet. So click register, then create your vendor account. So. Um, I'm just going to put anything here. Greg at blah, 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 dot com. Password, put your password in. If, if those are the same, if those two passwords are the same, I will, um, that would be unbelievable. First name. Okay, then click create login. What it's going to do is then send you an email that you need to click on to verify your account. Please find that email and we also need you to know that temporarily uh, the email will most likely go to your spam folder. Again, that's something that we're going to be fixing soon, but definitely if you don't find it in your inbox, uh, go to your uh, spam folder or your bulk mail folder. You'll find the email in there. Click the link on that and it's going to bring you to your uh, login page where you log in and this is the main user page that you will see. So um, now let me just go through each tab. Uh, what it will, what it's supposed to do is take you through each uh, tab automatically but there's a little bug. It's only going through I think a couple of the tabs. So what I just want to make sure you do in general is go through each tab on your own and just make sure that you have everything accounted for and complete. So my account, there's uh, the my account page. Uh, when you click on main user page, that takes you back to this page, which is important to know. So log out, we don't want to do that. Contact information, private phone number that we can use to reach you, not published. This is my phone number if you ever need anything uh, from me. This happens to be my address here, but that's your uh, information. Uh, to be publicly displayed on the website. Enter that, hit save. If it doesn't bring you to the next screen, just hit uh, main page and it'll bring you back here. Basic profile, click this. This is your uh, legal company name, public name to be listed on the website, phone number, etc. cetera, very uh, straightforward. Click save. Now go back to the main user page again, advanced profile. Advanced profile is where you enter uh, information about your business and you can upload a main photo which is right here you can enter YouTube URLs or Vimeo URLs here the Vimeo URLs may not be working immediately uh, at the moment uh, but um, definitely enter YouTube videos those do work those videos will show in the carousel on your page um, you know on your on your profile page and here's where you click photos so uh, you see I have these photos here and you can reorder them as you wish. These photos will show in the carousel automatically rotating on your page. Now you can upload multiple files by clicking this and you hit choose files. What that will do is allow you to select multiple images and you would just hit open and it uploads multiple images at a time. Very straightforward. Then when you're done with that, again, go back to main user page. Let's go to social media links. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, etc. Fill out all of those. Then go back to main user page. Make sure you hit save on every page before you leave that page. Uh, vendor specific information. This has to be filled out for your listing to appear on the listing page. Um, category one, I have it as videographer. You can select whichever. Uh, you are and again make sure you select it and hit save logo image file to put your logo in click choose file up you'll upload your logo hit save and then go back to the main user page okay so here is where you would click upgrade listing now everybody gets a free listing it's like a business card listing and that will be shown at the bottom of uh, the search results page wherever it appears so free listings at the bottom standard listings in the middle and featured listings go up to the top. 
very uh, happy to announce that we are giving everyone a free standard listing uh, until April 1st, 2019. Here's why. Because it's bridal booking season. It's engagement season. And we want the site to be as loaded as possible with as many vendors as possible. Um, instead of just free listings, we want to give the standard listing to as many vendors as possible that sign up and take advantage of this. So that will be beyond the April 1st point. That will be $35 a month. If you want a featured listing, that's $75 a month. So all you would have to pay if you wanted the feature listing now would be $40 a month for the first uh, four months of 2019. Then it would go up uh, to $75 from there. So either way, you can take advantage of the $35 a month free standard listing now um, uh, or, or the featured if you pay the difference. All right. So um, the free listing includes the business card information. The standard or featured include all of these here. You can check that out uh, as you go. On the page, make sure you fill it out as much as possible with text, images, video clips, etc., and have your brides go to your page as well and put in reviews for you uh, as well. Now, how you would do that is you would go to your profile page, all right, by doing a search for yourself. So I'm going to do a search here for videographers, all right. And we're going to go search, put in the zip code. Oh, oh, there we go. Greg Ricardi Productions. Click here. As many of you know, I'm a videographer. Uh, and this is what it looks like. Uh, the Vimeo items are not appearing yet. That's going to be fixed, but the, the YouTube videos do show. This is the carousel. And what did I want to show you here? Here at the bottom is where... Your brides can submit a review, and here's what you would do. You go to the top of the page, and you highlight this URL. Actually, you don't need anything past the end. You can clip this off. Anything after the end, you can clip that off and just highlight this. This is your direct link to your vendor profile page that you can send out to brides and grooms. And let me just prove to you that, that it works. I'm going to open up a new incognito window. I'm going to place the link in here. And there you go. So that's how that works. All right. Any questions, give us a call. My number is 201-424-5168 or call the main office number 8334-360-TOUR. Thanks so much. So excited to have you on the site and happy booking.